But let's go in here real quick, and I'm going to build a mobile app. And it's going to take me just a few moments, so just stick with me, and you're going to see this happen. So we're going to come up here, and we're going to say, Create a New Web App. And what I'm going to do, I've got a little tool on here called RoboForm, and I'm just going to hit it so that I can fill this information quickly so you don't have to sit here and watch. Now, one thing about our system here is if you have any questions, uh, sometimes like right here, this is wrong. So you have the opportunity to see exactly how you need to put your name in. Of course, you want to keep it short. So I'm just going to call this uh, MMC. Now you see that it's yellow right there? That means that that name's already been used. I can put a 1 right there and a 2, a 2, and now a 3. Now you can see that uh, number 3 had been used. So I know that that's going to be a good URL. And I'm going to click Add. And I have started creating my mobile app just that quick. I'm going to come up here to Edit Content, and I'm going to start putting some content in. You can see here the mobile app has started. It's kind of bland right now, but we're going to snazz her up. We're going to go to General Settings. We're going to go to Logo. I'm going to upload my image. Here is my image we're going to upload. And you can see it populate. Now I'm going to upload an icon. And we've got a little tool in here. It's a third-party tool. It's an icon creator going through uh, a Quirco. And you can just go in there. You can drop an image in there, and it will create your uh, icon. Really nice icon. And you'll see here, there's my icon. And now we're going to come down. We're going to come back to color settings, because I'm going to do some, some things in the color settings to, uh, to show you. So we're going to come back to that. So let's come in here, and we're going to start putting some content in. Your click-to-call phone number, you want to make sure that that's in there so you can have a click-to-call button. They say three of the most important things you need on a web app. Click-to-call information, directions, and an About Us information. Those are the three most important things you can have on a web app. So I'm going to just put some information in here. I made a mistake one time. I did a webinar, and I put my actual phone number in there, and uh, half the world had it. I've talked to thousands of people on this webinar, and then I realized that what I was doing and how did people get my phone number. The About Us information is just a brief overview of your business, which can be viewed on the mobile app. Once again, I'm going to click the magic button, and that's going to fill out. Well, I thought it would. I thought I had it in there, but maybe not. So let me go ahead and put it in here. I'm just going to say, we are the best. Email, you want to make sure your email is in there. Me at me.com. You can put your a full website URL. This would be your customer's web uh, URL. We're going to put the business information here. And you can see uh, with the magic button, I just did all that. You put the business name, the phone numbers, the uh, email address, their website URL. And you can come down here and check the address. Sometimes Google kind of doesn't put you in the right place. And you can see that that's OK. So I'm going to click Add. Now I can come down here. I can put my Facebook. I'm going to save that. I can put my Twitter account in there. Save that. Google Plus. I can put my YouTube channel, LinkedIn, and Pinterest, Yelp, Foursquare, Urban Spoon, and TripAdvisor. Now we're going to come back over here real quick, and you're going to see that I've already started developing my app. Now there's a couple of things I want to do. I want to make my app look really good. So I'm going to come in here, and I'm going to do some color match. I'm going to set my app up. I'm going to show you just how simple this is. First thing, I'm going to have a color here, and I'm going to make my tell I'm going to make my background black, and I'm going to make it this black right here. So I'm going to come over here to General Settings. I can either come up here and go like this, and drag and drop, and make that black, or I can actually take that color that I got, and I can put it as the background color, and I'm going to say uh, right here. And we'll make it the exact color of that image in the back. So you can see that that kind of changed that. Let me save that. Come over here to Preview. Now it's kind of set my background. You can see it's not as dark as that. So I'm going to come back and I'm going to fix that real quick. You can see how easy this is to do. So we'll save that. Now I'm going to change the color of my buttons. And I want my buttons to be gold. So I'm going to drag that over there. I'm going to put a little bit of fade on my buttons. I'm going to make this black. All right, I'm going to put a little fade on there, right there. I'm going to come over here, I'm going to save that. And you can see just how fast 
I've set up my app very quick. Now I can add a coupon to this. I'm going to come over here real quick. I want to put a coupon in there. Add a scratch off. I'm going to come in here and I'm going to select an image. I really like these with the background on it. You can see the previews here, what they look like. I, my favorite is number two. I like the gold. And then I'm going to put the background just a text. I'm going to save that. And you can see here that I've put my coupon in. I've got my click to call. I've got everything going on here. On the bottom, I've got my Facebook and Twitter. This app is ready to go. Absolutely ready to go. Now let me show you something here real quick. I'm going to bring over an emulator. Hope everybody can see that. Let me populate that real quick. And this is the way the scratch off coupons. How many of you ever got, here's the scratch off coupon. And you'll see it load up here. And this is what just boggles people's minds. And we're going to come in here and we're going to rub that off. Bam. And uh, that's not the coupon specific I just built. I just wanted to show you what it looked like in that emulator. But it rubs off just like any, any scratch off you go get at the store. So it works extremely, extremely well. Really, really cool. Uh, we've got some people that are holding up their hands. While I'm, uh, I just finished building this, and you can see how simple it is to build that out, I'm going to go ahead and take a couple of questions. Uh, let's see. Scratch offs are ready to be sold. I'm selling them every day. People just absolutely just love them. Well, we're going to roll on here. Now, if you want to test out the coupon, if you've got your smartphone in front of you, you can scan the app that I just showed you right here on the screen. I'll just leave it up there for a couple of seconds. Break out your smartphone, uh, and you will be able to uh, scan that in there, and it will just bring it right up on your screen. 